pity the fool who eats egg salad Pringles. Ugh. Let's see what's next. Let's do some Pringles. These are egg salad Pringles. Egg salad. I love egg salad, don't get me wrong, but I'm really apprehensive of how these are gonna taste. I've never seen egg salad Pringles before. So uh, wish me luck. Let's smell them first. Okay, I was scared they were gonna smell like rotten eggs, but they don't. So that's a good sign, I guess. I'm really apprehensive, but uh, here we go. Oh yeah, I smell the egg now. Oh, I, oh, I really smell the egg. Pleasant and disturbing Pringle experience I have ever had to go through. This giant X, not approved. Gross. Beware. Eat at your own risk. Nope, let's try something tasty. Yeah, let's get that flavor out of our mouth. Blech. Okay, so these are from the same people as those chips. These are like little, I think they're trying to mimic french fries and it's supposed to taste like baked potato and garden vegetables. Ugh. Ugh, I still taste egg. Let's give these a try. Mm. They don't smell like super exciting. They don't smell bad. Okay. Mm. A lot better than the, the egg solid Pringles. These are not salted at all. Like, I can't say these have salt on them. But they're really nice. I can taste carrot, parsley. Very buttery. Very, very buttery. Definitely, they don't make a bad little snack. So, uh, I approve these. This is from the same company as, the, as these and as the chips and whatnot. And these kind of look like the same thing, but these ones look more french fried shape. And if I'm right, this is buttered potato with sour cream and broccoli, or maybe chive or something like that. They have, they have like four different flavors of these. Just like uh, these ones you can get like cheese, uh, baked potato like these ones and a few other ones. Garden vegetables, I think. So these were not that much and you get one, two, three, four, five. You get, come in a pack of five. I like that they're individually wrapped and whatnot. Oh, those totally look like french fries. I have a weird feeling these are just gonna be stale french fries. I'm just saying, because that's a french fry. That is a french fry. Mmm. Those are really good. Mmm. They're really buttery. They have a really nice sour cream taste. And I want to say it is broccoli. I give these a, a passing mark. These definitely are approved. 
Oh, my belly is starting to get really mad at me. So we have another thing of Pringles. This time not egg flavored. Thank gosh. Ugh. This time we have yakisoba flavored Pringles. Yakisoba. I love yakisoba. So I think these are gonna be pretty good. Whew, those smell super yummy. Mmm. Mmm. Those taste totally like a yakisoba. I swear I can taste cabbage too. Mm -hmm. Let me do one more. Mmm. Really salty but savory with that yakisoba tang. These are much better than these. I don't recommend these. Don't, don't, don't hurt yourself like that. Treat yourself with kindness, people. Don't do this to yourself. Don't do egg salad Pringles to yourself. Just don't. Okay, so next we have Pokemon jellies. I guess these are like jello or something like that. Let's see. Okay, let's go for an Eevee. They all seem to be one flavor. I wasn't quite expecting that. I thought they were actually gonna be gummies, like jelly gummies, but this is like legit jello. Let's try. Okay, let's do this. Ooh, that smells really nice. Mm-hmm. Those are yummy. That's not bad. Wonder if, if I wonder if you can get different flavors. Grape is not my favorite flavor, but these are still really yummy. I approve these. Okay, we're almost done. We got some Gutama, the laziest egg cookies. Oh, sorry, these aren't cookies. These are chocolates filled with some cream sort of thing. I have no idea what type of cream, so uh, wish me luck. I'm a little nervous, a little nervous. Oh, those are cute. Okay, I'm nervous. I don't like chocolate that's filled with things usually. Smells like really nice chocolate. I was expecting something soft, like some sort of cream filling, but all this is is like a vanilla white chocolate inside of it. That's really tasty, actually. That's totally white chocolate. Well, those chocolates definitely aren't bad. I definitely approve of those chocolates, and there's quite a lot of them. I think there's, oh, I doesn't actually say how many there are, but there's a pretty fair amount for what you have to pay for them. Okay, so next we're gonna try, it's like a fish cookie. I mean, it's not fish flavored, but it's just in the shape of a fish. And then it has some sort of uh, filling, wafer filling. So uh, let's try this. That looks interesting. This is the cookie. Giant fishy. Don't know what actually it is in the center. I guess the wafer is the outside cookie. Okay, well, let's check this out. This is not my cup of tea. Anybody who likes vanilla wafers and hazelnut fluff might like this. Chocolatey and nutty. I actually don't like hazelnut spread. I'm not a fan of Nutella. And this, it reminds me of Nutella, 100%. Not a huge fan of this but I can't say it's gross because I know people who would like hazelnut or Nutella spread would definitely like this, but not for me, nope. So next I have the other Pokemon cookies. Hopefully these Pokemon cookies are a lot better than uh, these ones, because I didn't like these ones. Okay. Oh, look at 
look at that. I got Diglett with its luscious golden locks. I think these are double chocolate flavor. Let's see. That's a really soft little cookie. I wasn't expecting it them to be soft. I was expecting them to be hard. It's the cookie. These are surprisingly really tasty. They're double chocolate. The cookie itself is very mild. And then the chocolate, the chocolate uh, chips are super sweet. Mm, I really like that. Those are much better than the cookies before them. Okay, so the last treat for this video is going to be some mochi. I think that's what it's called, mochi. It's cherry never actually tried mochi before so uh let's go for it cute little container oh weird oh i just broke the container in half oh weird okay so it comes with a little uh toothpick for you to use okay let's try this It just tastes like cherry, a cherry gummy, like a cherry fruit gummy. That's exactly what these taste like. I'm loving how you eat them though. This makes me feel so refined for some reason. I'm meant to toothpick. Oh. Mwah. Delicious. But in all seriousness, these are really tasty. They're not as sweet as a fruit gu gummy, and I like that. I definitely approve of that. Oh. I lied. Sorry, we got one more mochi. This is a strawberry mochi. So we'll see how they compare. I have to say there's quite the size difference. These are nice and tiny. These are huge. So let's try this. Okay, I don't know about this. These are... Oh. Oh my god, these are goopy, like like they jiggle oh my god I'm so scared to eat this oh my god I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it it's mushy it's like flubber really pretty on the inside <laughs> oh why ah uh. like no no I can't do it <sighs> now I gotta go through all this stuff and uh figure out, you know, maybe I'll give some of the stuff I'm not too uh, keen on to other people. Maybe they'll be more keen on it. But overall, I think that was pretty good. I liked most of the things. There were a uh, few things. These. No. No. Just no. No. Gross. Those are just a giant no. There's just certain things you don't need in life. This was a stress I never needed to experience in my life. My tongue could have gone its entire lifespan without this flavor ever coming in contact with it. I would have been okay. I would have been okay. But now I will forever have this memory burned into my taste buds. When I look at egg salad sandwiches in the future, I will always be reminded of the Pringles that almost ruined egg salad for me. <sighs> yeah, overall, that was a pretty good little candy treat haul. Can't believe I still have, I have another full thing of treats and candies, and then I have a DIY candy, a couple little uh, sets. That's gonna be a video in itself. And then I have like six different things of ramen that I got from Japan haul. So I'm gonna do just a ramen video. 
because I didn't think mixing all this candy treats with ramen was a super smart idea. So we're gonna do that next time or after uh, a few other videos. But yeah, my belly is so angry with me right now. I feel like I need to go curl up in a corner and think about my life choices and why I do this to myself and then move on and eat some candy. Yeah, that sounds pretty good to me. Thought I'd introduce my, one of my kitties to you guys. This is Loki. He's my Bangle Tabby mix. He's a pretty big boy. Yeah, are you a big boy? I love you. Okay. Say hi to the people. Say hi, people. Say hi, people. I'm gonna get going here. I think I'm a little bit brain dead from how much candy I just ate. When I say my stomach hurts, that's not me just trying to be like, oh, I ate so much candy, my stomach hurts. My stomach really does hurt. I think this video was a little, a little tough on me. So what are your guys' thoughts and opinions on all this candy down below? Would you have tried the egg salad Pringles or would have you just been like, nope, I'm saving myself that. You know, I'm not gonna put myself through that. You know, what do you guys think? I'd love to know your opinions and thoughts down below. Um, but yeah, if you liked this video, a like is always appreciated. It helps, you know, me in the long run, you know. It's always nice. My cat, you know, really suggests you like this video. Leave a like, leave a like, leave a like. Well, you gotta listen to the cat. She says leave a like, so you better leave a like. And if you guys feel like it, you could always subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my videos I'll be posting in the future. I'm going to be coming out with quite a few different videos here soon. I got my Zoo Lily Part 2 uh, haul coming out. I have two more like candy videos coming out. And I have another Yume Twins uh, July's uh, Yume Twins box I still have to do. So that's a lot of videos I have already planned. So you don't want to miss those. Anyways, everybody, I hope you all have a wonderful day or night. And I'll see you all next time. Bye! I pity the fool who eats egg salad Pringles. Ugh.